the England keeper, 24, could not keep out strikes from Mario Mandzukic and Ivan Perisic as the three Lions crashed out to Croatia after extra time. Chants of, we are proud of you, were blasted out at the final whistle as the players lined up in an almost transfixed place at the thousands of England fans filling the stadium. Some had paid more than £1,000 a ticket as England came so close to their first final in the competition since they won it in 1966, after 20 minutes of emotion on the pitch, where players barely said a word to each other while Southgate comforted each and every one, the England stars returned to the dressing room to rousing applause. But barely a supporter left. Slowly, one by one, the players re-emerged where they met with friends and families watching from the stands. Eddie Jordan Pickford took off his gloves and gave them to a fan after England crashed out the World Cup and then it was Pickford's turn. He made a beeline for his friends and family before approaching the England fans to pay a special thanks. With England's number one being blasted out by the brass band, Pickford hopped over the advertising hoardings before taking off his gloves and giving them to one lucky fan then turned to applaud again as he was given a rapturous ovation from travelling fans. It had all started so well for England. Croatia captain Luka Modric conceded a free kick with a clumsy challenge on Deli Alley after five minutes and Kieran Trippier superbly curled home the set-piece for his first international goal. England could then have had the semi won by halftime, but Harry Maguire, Harry Kane and Jesse Lingard all failed to finish clear chances. And England were made to pay when Croatia, after dominating possession in the second half, equalised in the 68th minute through Perisic, the winger Jose Mourinho has tried to sign for Manchester United. Masukic then scored the winner in the second period of extra time to break English hearts. Getty Jordan Pickford sunk to the floor as Croatia celebrated reaching the World Cup final Getty a deflated Kane said, it's tough. We're gutted, you know. We worked so hard, it hurts and it'll hurt for a while, but we can hold our heads up high, it was a fantastic journey, we got further than anyone thought we could, we've just got to learn from it, we created some good chances being 1-0 up, there are lots of ifs and buts and it is hard in these games, it is small margins and it went their way today. Played well at the start and in extra time but we missed a few chances to kill them off, until they scored in the second half we were always under the cosh. Maybe we dropped too deep at times. There is a lot we could have done better but they played better, obviously it has been great to get to this stage and we know. We have done everyone proud but we wanted to win, now England have to pick themselves up to face Belgium in the third place playoff against Belgium in St. Petersburg on Saturday.